How often do you look at guys on the street and think that they're hot? <laughs> <laughs> Dad bod versus muscly. What are some red flags you see in a guy? The plumber the other day? Yeah, we had a plumber on this the street. Like an <laughs> okay, well welcome back everyone. We are doing guys ask questions. Guys are too... No. Guys ask questions... Asking girls, girls, girls questions, girls are too afraid to ask. Asking girls questions, guys are too afraid to ask. If you haven't seen, we've done two of these on Joy's channel, but the other way around. But today I have about 25 questions for you. 25. 25. <laughs> 25. To be exact. Yeah. Can I also say, I got my wisdom teeth out and my face is still swollen and I can't smile very big. <laughs> and so sometimes I do this to relax the tension. So go back, watch the Joy's videos, and compare her face size. And I'm yeah. here with... Chloe. <laughs> <laughs> they should already know. Wow. <laughs> yeah. I'm Heidi. There you go. What do I do if I'm too nervous to talk to you in person? So... Yeah, I reckon well, well, if you have something like in common that you already know about, or like if you know something that they're interested in and you can try to get them talking about that, and that could... Yeah could last a while, like Spark Joy, you just, you just talk about film or yeah, well, Instagram. Yeah, why do you want to approach me? <laughs> <laughs> about that, oh. Okay, cool. <laughs> um, okay, so number two is features of a guy's body that jump out at you. I mean, eyes, eyes yeah. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. I'd probably say lips. I mean, if they're shirtless, then... I think lips for me, because it's just like... Yeah. Like, if someone's yeah. talking to you and you look at their lips... You know in movies yeah. how, like, you see them yeah, like, before like, they kiss yeah. and they're looking down, I'm yeah, like, oh. But it's also, like, like, so you don't completely, like, miss. <laughs> Lining it up. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah do you prefer relationship sex or casual hookup sex? Relationship, relationship sex. sex. Obviously. Yeah. I think it's because there's more of a connection. Yeah. Being as close... It's, like, physically close as possible to somebody that you really care about and... Mm. And it's comfortable. Yeah. 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 Well, I think for a lot of girls, even guys, like talking to a lot of my guy friends, they've been like, yeah, I way prefer it when it's like I'm in love or really, really attracted to the person. Yeah. But like, I think for girls especially, like emotions are so connected to sexuality. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And like, like the feeling. Yeah. Like, true. I think it really affects how turned on you feel and how good something feels, totally. literally, by how like, much you yeah. love mm -hmm. someone. It's like, you're making love. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. that's true. Making love always makes me cringe. It's, like, yeah, yeah, dude, it sounds so old. <laughs> Number four, what are you thinking during sex? Like, what usually goes through your girls' heads? Nothing. <laughs> Just how good it feels. You're like, yeah. feeling what you're feeling. Okay, that's way less complicated than boys' brains. Really? <laughs> yes. You think less complicated. I thought you guys would be thinking about like everything, but like. I mean, what do you think me, about that? It's so much stuff. How often do you look at guys on the street and think that they're hot? <laughs> <laughs> way too often. Yes. And the other day we were at a cafe and the guy was like outside and I was like, Chloe, and she like just straight up looks over and goes, what? And we like make eye contact. With him. <laughs> I really, I didn't think. And he was not even that attractive. Out, anyway. Roof to the guy on the street. Well, no, he was, he was beautiful. But you know when you like see someone from a distance and you're like, oh my god, yeah. and then they get closer. Yeah, and you're like, yeah. oh, you're like, oh. Human, like everyone. No. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, the plumber the other day. Yeah, we had a plumber come. I guess it was an on <laughs> the street. Like <laughs> <an intro laughs> <before. laughs> yeah. Yeah. Our sink is yeah. broken. And now the now the other one's broken, so we can call him again. <laughs> oh no. Do you actually have some ice? Uh, yeah, probably. What yeah. is a hint girls give guys? <laughs> okay. And for me, if like I'm kind of extra like touchy or something, if like you find kind of like an excuse to like touch them or something, you'd be like, oh, like what is this? Or like <laughs> things. <laughs> if I'm interested in a guy, then I'll find them like a bit more funny or like I'm more sarcastic. Kind yeah, of. I feel like you're definitely more sarcastic. <laughs> yeah. Like I can yeah. tell when you like a guy because you'll be sarcastic the queen. Yeah. yeah. No, I don't know. I don't think I have any hints. I guess just like... Just, yeah, like the last video I said, you yeah. would be so hard I'd to decide. So because I'm so flirty with everyone in a yeah. way. Or not flirty, but I think I've told every guy that I've... That I've yeah. Like, I'll have crushes on heaps of guys, but I don't necessarily want it to go anywhere. I'm out. starting to realise you know? that, like, you can have a crush on someone but not want, like, a oh, relationship with yeah. them. Because, mm -hmm. like, when I... Like, as a boy, you're just like, oh, I have a crush on them person like, I need to date them. Yeah. 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 Yeah, I guess trying to like hang out with them more than usual, but then it's also like I guess that's if you don't know them super well, because if you're already really close friends then you're probably just hanging out a lot anyway. I guess also that just like if you're at a group thing, like 
be paying more attention to them or making more conversation with them mm. than other people. Yeah, like special attention. Yeah, I attention. think definitely yeah. group things you can see vibes. Yeah, so easily. But like one-on-one on one maybe it's harder. It's yeah. Harder. yeah. Yeah. Well, that's or where like, we get confused, guys, because if it's one-on-one, -on -one, we're like, what the hell is this? <laughs> <laughs> like what the hell? That's just, yeah. I find yeah. that so funny when guys like hype up other guys and they're like, no, no, she's down. Yeah, and then she's Jackson, like, yeah. Jackson is the worst. <laughs> Do you like eye contact during sex? Mm -hmm. if, yeah, yeah, if it's someone you 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 like. I if like, they have their eyes open and are looking around the room, then yeah, they're like, oh. looking at me, then like <laughs> yeah. straight past. I feel me. like it's like kind of in some ways sort of like connects you a bit more if they're yeah. like mm. looking directly. At your in your eyes. No, I love yeah. it. Yeah. When you have that moment where you both just are like, whoa. Do you prefer subtlety or upfront? Upfront. Upfront. Up front. Yeah. Like honestly, oh, subtlety no. is so <laughs> subtlety is so annoying. annoying. Yeah. Just yeah. Like, and then it's kind of that like, oh, am I just imagining it? Yeah. Or like, are up they actually hot. interested? Up front yeah, is it so actually sexy. is. Like it's okay. like it might catch you off guard, and you might be like, whoa. Yeah. yeah, as long as it's up front just so you know. Yeah, 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 yeah. like... Then it's like, it's, it's, it's like, it's oh, on the plate. okay, well, yeah. how do I feel? What do I... Okay, yeah. Like. yeah. When is it appropriate Sorry. to tell girls you don't know that they're cute or pretty? You don't know? Like, girls yeah. that like, you... So girls, if it's like somebody like at a cafe... Oh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, Jarvis literally... Oh, whatever. Let's <laughs> go. Answer the question. Oh. I reckon after, like, a few times of kind of going in, and if it's sort of been a bit... Okay, let's just morph into the cafe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Like, there's kind of a bit of flirt, and you're sort of getting vibes. Yeah, you have to be getting the vibes, because otherwise, like, they might be really not want to hear that yeah but if you're like mm -hmm. if you have been i don't know you're having some banter or whatever then you know what's really true. fucked up is that if it was like a guy that i was like oh he's cute and he said that to me i'd be like oh but if it was a guy i was like not into at all i'd yeah. probably find it kind of creepy which is yeah. why i'm saying like you feel like up, it's kind of like vibing and you're also kind oh of yeah no but that's that's fair like if you like you're not attracted to a person then well, you want to know their vibe yeah i don't know but if you just yeah like, you don't have to be attracted like, to not, everyone i feel it yeah. depends on the type of compliment too if it's like exactly. i like your hair then it's like whatever. yeah yeah mm. but if yeah. it's like you're really beautiful then it's like that's oh. like quite <laughs> i personally love compliments but sometimes i'll give yeah. people compliments and they're like Definitely. not even necessarily like guys but like yeah some people just take it better than others well from that i think stick to more specific compliments yeah and, yeah and you'll play it safe thoughts on pda Mm. It depends how intense um, it is. Yeah, Sometimes exactly. it's kind of like really cute, but if people are like making out and there's like a lot of tongue yeah, and it's just sort of like, and you're shit. sort of like, do I look? Like, should I look away? <laughs> it's sort of, yeah, I don't really like if people are like going at it okay. yeah. next to me. I like don't want to look at them. It makes me uncomfortable. Oh, I've, yes. I've seen uh, like some guys full on literally under, like groping underneath. Literally and I was no, like, right the the yeah, and I'm yeah. like, dude, we're oh going into God. a movie. <laughs> Yes! Oh my god! Um, it's always at the cinema. Oh my yeah. Oh it was my like god! Kids <laughs> yeah. But I do. If I just see a random couple like kissing or being cute, I'm like, oh. Yeah. 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 But if they're like going at it, I'm like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What are some common boundaries that shouldn't be crossed in a relationship? Like the breaking of trust, I reckon, is for me a big one. Like, but also just like if you share something to keep that between mm. the two of you. Yeah. But yeah, like lying. If someone was lying to me, I would that would exactly betray my trust completely. Yeah. And then yeah. something I not something that um, bothers me. But going on somebody else's phone, and like just kind of like mm. looking through things. I've yeah. like heard of experiences where that happens to people and I just or like people do it and I just don't but then that's feel like bottom line that like that's back to trust from, from my experience I think like with boundaries that shouldn't be crossed also is like you got to realize that the other person has their life like their life yeah. Yeah. does actually revolve around them yeah like yeah as selfish as it sounds yeah, yeah it and that can include like family and other friends and like family friends and hobbies and, and hobbies and yeah and everything yeah, yeah. I was talking you, you can't really get in the way of those things. I was talking, yeah, I was talking to um, Loz about this this morning. Just that, like, when you're in a relationship, I think it's really important that you still each have your own World, singular life and your own friends. And, like, obviously mm. it's great if you're dating someone and they're also good friends with your friends, but, like, yeah. they should have their own life as well. 
Because otherwise, I think after a while, it might get kind of like... Dependent. Yeah, dependent and even a bit suffocating because you're like, I also mm. want to have my own independent life. And if it were to like end, then the people would kind of be like, what Cruise. do I do now? Yeah. Like, yeah. I've been relying on this person for And your whole years, lives are together. Yeah, mm. especially if you have all the same friends and it's like, yeah. so like, yeah. who you get to? Yeah. But yeah. I mean, also, Take a know, pick. share. Take a pick <laughs> yeah. out of the marble bag. <laughs> What are some red flags you see in a guy? Oh, mm. like if they don't want you to hang out with other male friends? That's, yeah. That's a red yeah. flag yeah. if they that's care about like what you wear. And... Just like all the toxic yeah. traits, you know, if they're like um, possessive or yeah. make you feel bad when you say no. Yeah. 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 If you're like, oh, yeah. I actually have to put this thing first, like family or something. Yeah. Like, actually, and they make you feel bad or like you're being a bad partner for having a life outside of them. Mm. Yeah, something for me, like, if, if if it's, like, a new person and maybe they come up to you and are, like, flirting with you or something and, like, they seem, like, nice and stuff, but I have had experiences when they've, like, been talking to me, but, like, flicking Looking down. Yeah. <laughs> and I'd be like, okay, so... Yeah. <laughs> it's so not subtle as well. It's yeah. So yeah. Shit. Like, yeah. I think yeah. they think they're being subtle, stupid, but it's like, yeah. guys, we can see it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> What are some green flags then? <laughs> if he supports you, yeah, I think support is a really big thing. If that, yeah, if yeah. he's like supportive of like most things that you do, and you feel like really good and really comfortable to talk to him about mm. anything, yeah, then that's always good. Yeah, mm. um, like you feel like he's not gonna judge you. Yeah, for that. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and just also for me, like a red, a, a green flag. Um, a blue flag. A blue flag. <laughs> a green flag would definitely be like, or something that I find really attractive in a guy is when they have their own drive. Like if they have mm. a goal and a drive mm. to do things. If he has a good relationship with his family. Mm. Yeah. yeah, family. Little yeah. things like that. Yeah, like if yeah. you, I guess if you're meeting someone for like the first time, you can kind of gauge of what kind of person they are. if. Like, yeah. about how they treat other people. Yeah, or like status or friends or family. stuff. Oh, that was another thing with the red flag status. Like, when a guy's all like... Yeah, well, like, I don't want to do that because it'll hurt my image you can, Yeah, you can just really tell he puts it on with certain people. Oh, mm. uh, like, yeah. Uh, yeah. Like yeah. Like, we'll okay. treat you differently. Yeah. 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 Or that were two pretty good questions. You got some good answers. <laughs> Thanks, guys. So, two good ones. <laughs> 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 Anyway, I'm gonna go hug my family. <laughs> Thoughts on a partner watching porn? Oh, that's a good one, Javi. Depends, like, how often and what type of porn. Yeah. Like, obviously, if you're away or they're away or something, you're not gonna see each other for a while. Whatever. Yeah. Gotta mm. Yeah. Sort yourself mm. out. I personally, unless I talked to my partner and he explained why he was doing that, Mm. And it became clear that it was for healthy, good reasons, and it wasn't. Then I would be okay with it, but uh, it doesn't make. I don't. Love yeah. It. I, if yeah. I'm being honest, I'm like, yeah, I wouldn't care if my partner was watching porn. Like, I'm like, yeah. why? I if think, we were. I don't know. I think like yeah. Well, that's and that's why it kind of depends on like what type, because and mm. yeah, because then it's like. I don't know, you want, don't want them to have like unrealistic expectations of what yeah. yeah what they expect from you. Yeah. At the same time, yeah. if it's like, yeah, so if it's your sexual partner and they're watching like a lot of porn, like maybe you might then be like, is it like you're yeah. not feeling fulfilled with me or whatever? Well, like, are you are seeking just, something like, else? A lot of guys are just addicted to porn. Yeah. And yeah. then I'm also like, I don't know. I think, I think communication yeah. 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 is like so definitely. needed because and you... If either partner is watching porn, then like you know you yeah, might get into your head that like, am I not? Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, yeah. Are you wanting to like look at hotter people or like what's yeah, the go? Yeah, yeah. Exactly. exactly. That's what I mean. So if my I found like <clears throat> my partner was watching porn more than like every once in a while, just because like yeah, oh, no, what you the hell, to be like yeah. super regular. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. But yeah. like was like yeah, watching it regularly, I'd probably want to have a conversation yeah. and see where that stems from. Yeah, yeah. because no, I, I don't think that. in a in a relationship. I would, but I just don't, yeah, yeah. I'm not necessarily yeah. super drawn to Speak porn. Speak yeah, and then communicate. Yeah. Communication is key to successful relationship. Make your own porn, basically. <laughs> no, but pretty much <laughs> the, the answer to your question is pretty much, I wouldn't feel that great about mm -hmm. it. 
without talking about without it. Without understanding that, what yeah. was stemming behind it. Well, that's all 20 questions of that. Smash and now through. we have a couple of rapid fire. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah. Oh, it's gone so yeah. fast. Dad bod versus muscly. Dad bod, weirdly. Well, how muscly? Depends how muscly, <laughs> yeah. Like, if it's like bodybuilder, yeah. then it's like too much. Yeah, exactly. And then I would yeah. definitely prefer But if it's like, they're just a bit bod. toned. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I don't yeah. want like a dad bod, but like... <laughs> dad bod sounds gross. Yeah. <laughs> but when I think muscly, I just think like really muscly, and I'm like, I, I, yeah. just, like, I just like a natural. Kind of in the between. Yeah. Yeah. Care if a boy is a virgin? It depends. Uh, what for. Yeah, it depends. Yeah, it depends. <laughs> Hotter for a guy to be dominant or submissive? Well, this dominant. is really yeah. 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 Dominant. But it's this a preference. Is, yeah, this is preference. Yeah. This yeah. is definitely preference. Mine's definitely dominant. Dominant. Yeah. Yeah. Dominant. 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 <laughs> dominant. 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 Well, I've been gathering them for like for the past three months, because, <laughs> like since we started it. But yeah, you guys all had really good question uh, answers. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. I your answers. That was harder than I expected. Yeah, me too. Like yeah. some of them, I'm just like, oh. Yeah. 